To write the formula for chromium-3 nitrate, let's first write the element symbols. So on the periodic table, if you look up chromium, it's Cr. And chromium, that's a transition metal. We can tell by the Roman numerals here. When we look at the nitrate, that A-T-E on the end, that means we're going to have a polyatomic ion. So you either memorize that the nitrate ion is NO3 and has a charge of 1 minus, or you can look it up on a table if you're allowed to do that. So we said the nitrate, it has a charge, the whole thing, the whole NO3 of 1 minus. The chromium, this 3, tells us we have this 3 plus ionic charge. And this isn't an ion. It's a neutral compound. It doesn't say ion after it. So since we have a neutral compound, all of the charges, they have to add up to 0. We need a net charge of 0. So we can use something called the crisscross method. We can move the 3 over here and the 1 down here. By convention, we don't write the 1. Get rid of that. And then let's get rid of these charges here real quick. And this 3 means we have 3 nitrate ions. So we do need to put parentheses around the 3. And this is the formula for chromium-3 nitrate. Let's check our work, though. We said each nitrate ion is 1 minus, and the whole chromium has that 3 plus. So 3 times 1 minus, that's 3 minus. 3 minus and 3 plus adds up to 0. Net charge is 0. This is the formula for chromium-3 nitrate. And this is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.